Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog. Today is Saturday and I went to the gym this morning and then came home, made breakfast, and now Cam and I are going to run some errands. The snow looks so cool. I know. Like we got a little raindrop leaf. <laughs> Now I like super need a new camera that just broke it even more. Well, I guess that was the universe deciding what you need. Cam. That was not my fault. Yes, it was. Like you getting into the car made it fall off. Maybe someone should have secured it better. She doesn't like me. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to run some errands. And I think I might go get a new vlog camera because this one is just going to shit. Just broke this one, I guess. You did. This camera was already like broken and it just keeps breaking more and I just want a new camera. So we're gonna at least go look at new cameras right now. Sorry, um, I broke your camera. It's okay. You did. Oh, yeah, so. It was personally no, I broke my... it. It was on my phone. <laughs> I can't um, believe I did that. I can't believe I was so thoughtless. A lot of people are out darting today. We decided against that because it's fucking cold and I just don't really want to darty. I think I'm too old for darties now. I think I'm too old for darties. <laughs> okay. Did I hijack your vlog? What's up everybody? Howdy. <laughs> you broke my camera. What the fuck? <laughs> I did not end up buying a new camera. I just decided it wasn't my day and I also couldn't even turn on and try the one that I wanted to look at the quality of. So I didn't buy a new camera, but we just went to the grocery store and we always get a bunch of like fun snacks to try. And today we got two different kinds of caviar. I know this isn't good caviar, but it's literally all they had. So we're just gonna try it. We also got ca creme fresh and ruffles. They didn't have bellinis. Well, maybe they did, we just couldn't buy them. I'm gonna do a healthy serving of caviar. Why do you not do any? I did. There's barely any, Cam. Yeah. Okay. You're not supposed to do this much as you just did. Yes, you are. No, you're not. Why? <laughs> salty. As fuck. It's also really salty with the potato chip. I wish there was yeah. bellinis. I'm scared of the salmon one, but someone has to do it. Ew, it's so slimy. Yeah, that's why I didn't want to try it. I don't like it. Yeah. Actually, I don't mind it. <laughs> <laughs> the ruffles are just really salty. I look crazy, but good morning. It's Monday morning. Yesterday was a bit of a rough one. Oh, I'm so puffy right now. Sometimes just the day after drinking, my anxiety is just like unmanageable. Like it's just insanely bad. I had to work on some homework and I don't know why, but this one class that I'm in right now is just like really stressing me out. And sometimes when I'm like doubtful about an assignment, I just like create this idea that it's impossible for me to do in my head. And like once I like deem something impossible, then I just like procrastinate the shit out of it. And and then once I actually have to do it, I have like a mental breakdown. Even if it's something that like I know I'm capable of, I just like convince myself that I can't do it. And it just gives me a lot of anxiety and like creates more problems. We had a rough day yesterday. It's fine. Start to a new week today. It's Monday. Fresh start. I also started my luteal phase yesterday. And I don't know if you guys remember when I had my ovarian cyst, but I feel like that was like low key a sign of like maybe PCOS or something. I have like really insane periods. And then also like when I start my luteal phase, I literally have so many mood swings. I feel like I turn into a different person. But yeah, that started yesterday. So that was another factor into my anxiety yesterday. It's a fresh start, a new week, and we're gonna have a good week. This is the second to last week of the two classes that I'm in right now because they're eight week terms. Final projects and stuff are kind of this week and next. We're gonna get it done and then I have a fresh start with new classes, which I love. Anyways, I woke up at Cam's this morning. I just like got a little bit presentable. My face is so puffy from crying and I'm trying to decide if I wanna go to the gym right now or not or if I just want to work out at home. I don't have a ton I need to get done today. I just want to start editing this vlog and working on my homework for the week. I think I only have one ad to shoot in the beginning of this week which is super nice. I'm kind of stalling right now because Cam is at his workout and I like when he gets home and can help me carry my things to my car after the weekend because I have so many bags. Whenever the neighbors move upstairs I like think someone's out the door and I was debating if I just want to stay here during the day today and work here but I feel like it's kind of nice to go home and unpack and repack because I am coming back here tonight to watch The Bachelor. I'm sorry, I kind of sucked at vlogging this weekend. I wanted to be better and then I don't even know what happened. I did not end up buying a new camera, which is why we're still in this one. I really want to get one because I want my quality to be really good for you guys and I feel like better quality would inspire me to film more because I just like want to be putting out the best quality content. But also recently, I've just been trying to be really smart with my money, no like impulse buying. So I'm just going to think about it for a while and like see if it's really necessary because I have two working cameras right now. Like they work. They're just not like the best quality that I would want for you guys. So that's my little Monday morning update. I think I'm gonna go home right now. I don't know if I'm gonna go to the gym or not. I need to decide that. I feel like it would be nice to just get my workout done for the day, but I also just don't wanna go to the gym.
I'm so excited. My new sheets just came in and I'm so excited about these. I have been desperately in need of new sheets and I have been wanting Brooklyn and sheets for the longest time. I've only heard good things about these sheets and I cannot wait to feel them. I'm just gonna open the pillowcases just so I can feel it. So these sheets are from Brooklinen. This video is actually sponsored by Brooklinen. I'm so excited to be working with them. My bed means a lot to me. I love like having a clean cloud looking bed, which is why I got the white sheets. They do have some amazing colors though. I was so torn because I really wanted a good white set of sheets because I just love having a white set, but I also wanted to branch out and get a color set. So the next set that I get might have to be their blue tide color because I love that color. I was having such a hard time choosing between the white and that color. They also just launched a ton of exciting new colors so you guys should go check those out. I got the Lux Hardcore Bundle and it comes with pillowcases, a duvet cover, and the sheets. Instead of buying all the individual items, you save 20% when you get the bundle, which is super nice. These sheets are 480 thread count, so they're so luxurious feeling and I just cannot wait to sleep in these. So I'm gonna wash these, put them on my bed, and then I wanna check back in with you guys in the morning after I've slept in them. It's the next morning. I can confirm I slept so good last night. I felt like I was sleeping in a five-star hotel bed. Plus, they just look so good. I'm obsessed with the way they look. Everything that I've heard about these sheets is true. They're amazing. I slept so good. 10 out of 10 recommend. I also have a discount code for you guys of $20 off of any order over $100. So I'm gonna put my code here on the screen and in the description box below that you guys can use to shop at Brooklyn Inn. Thank you again to Brooklyn Inn for sponsoring this video. Woke up at Cam's first stop of the day is the gym. I am home now. I've been sitting doing some work and also plotting my spring break outfits because I want to order everything now so I'm not stressed about it and like last minute because I always am. Everything is so expensive. So I'm literally making like a Canva thing and like planning all of my outfits. There's just so many cute things I want to buy that are so expensive and I just like can't justify spending $200 on every piece. But I'm about to hop on a call for an upcoming ad that I'm doing with a brand and sometimes brands just like to do calls before you shoot the ad just so that they can really go over like in depth everything they want out of the ad and sometimes it's just easier over a call so this calls in two minutes i'm gonna hop on this and then probably continue my spring break shopping <laughs> i should be doing homework but i'll worry about that later yeah i'm gonna hop on this now I'm gonna make a little bevy. The Croix sent over a new flavor, mojito. I love making drinks in like big mason jars like this. I kinda wanna try it just on its own. It's actually good. It has like the spice that a mojito, a mojito has. This is like how I get myself to drink water because I've been really bad recently. Fill the rest with just normal water. Some mio, straw. It's kind of interesting with the little spice that the mojito flavor has. I don't know if I like it. It's drinkable. Morning. It is Wednesday. I think it's Wednesday, right? Yeah. 
Wednesday. I wish that I could look more presentable in my vlogs, but the truth is this is just what I look like 90% of the time and I feel like I've been just so puffy. Just not looking my best recently. This is just how the winter goes for me. Anyways, the agenda for the day. I have been doing so much online shopping for spring break. I need to do something that's more worthwhile, so I'm gonna work on a bunch of homework today. I have to shoot an ad, continue editing this vlog, and I'm gonna work out. My homework will be like the biggest chunk of this day. Like I said earlier, I have like final projects and stuff this week and next so i kind of have a lot to do whenever i have these big assignments i kind of just put them off which is bad because i need to be working on them <laughs> yeah that's my plan for the day i'm headed to cams for the night it's 8 30 i feel like i still look half asleep but i just did a really good workout my body randomly woke me up at like 6 30 today so i laid in bed until 7 and then just did my workout and i feel like i'm set up to have a good friday i'm gonna go upstairs make my coffee breakfast shower self tan and then get some work done and then we can have a good weekend mm -hmm. 